In 2003, Kenneth Wynemko was released from prison, exonerated after nine years behind bars for a brutal rape he did not commit. I knew I was innocent, and I knew I didn't know how long it was going to take, but I knew that I would be here. One of only a handful of exonerations ever in Macomb County, the Innocence Project and attorney Gail Pamikov helped set him free. It's also a victory for DNA testing and the, and the promise that that testing brings to the, the criminal justice system as a whole. And now, nearly 20 years later, Pamikov, who now lives in Chicago, is returning to Macomb County, joining prosecutor Peter Lucido as chief of their new conviction integrity unit. It is an attempt to right a wrong. It doesn't fix the underlying wrong, but it's a step in the direction of fixing the wrong. Although the justice system isn't perfect, we're going to try to get it right today, moving forward, for those that sit behind those bars. People like Marvin Cotton Jr. and the many other exonerees working with local prosecutors' offices to form conviction integrity units to review new evidence and free the innocent. It was important to really have a voice in the room um, because at a certain point in time, being an exoneree, you know, we were victims of the system. Cotton, freed after 19 years in prison for a crime he didn't commit, spoke with Fox 2 earlier this month about the importance of their activism. We are living, breathing um, um, proof that the system failed, but we also are living, breathing proof that the system can work. Which is what Lucido and Pamikov are hoping to make happen, an estimated 2 to 5 percent of the 2 million people in prison in the United States are innocent. 5 percent of that is over 100,000 people in prison that are innocent. In Michigan, 33,000 people are behind bars, an estimated 1,600 wrongfully convicted. Aaron Salters, 15 years. Eric Anderson, 9 years. Anthony Legion, 19 years, 10 months. Months and years the innocent can't get back, making the mission of Macomb County's new conviction integrity unit all the more urgent. Even one life that sits behind bars is too much. That's innocent. In Macomb County, Amy Lang, Fox 2 News.